Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. Um, this is a quick one. Um, so you may have seen videos um, on Facebook of these animals that are in some pretty crappy situations and um, they're just, they're in these really bad situations um, and then these people, they go and they save them. I'm going to put that in air quotes. Well, I came across one of those. Now, here's my backstory on this. Um, so, the problem with all of these people is that um, they fake their videos. They stage them. And... And this isn't, like, this isn't a good thing because they, like, it's, other people have talked about it better than I have and that I'm about to. Um, but I'm going to try to explain it to the best of my ability and try to take up any time. Um, basically, what these people do is they take these dogs or these animals and they put them in these situations intentionally and then they go and they try to fake rescue them and act like they're the people that are the best people in the world and they you know they they do all of the saving and oh look at me i save all these animals i rescue all these animals now listen people can rescue animals it's fine right um and that's absolutely fine. If you, if you, if you um, unintentionally, you know, find an animal that is in danger and you save them, like, that's a good thing, right? But it's not a good thing when you post these videos faking um, all of this. Um, I'm not going to show any of the videos, but I want you guys to just look at this for a second and like homeless dog suddenly shows up on driveway, you know, and, you know, and then this is the one that I found on Facebook, which is called watch this puppy who couldn't even stand learn to run, which the puppy is stuck in um, water um, and can't get out, except here's the thing. If that dog was really stuck, it would look more stuck than it actually is, obviously. I don't think it's actually stuck. It doesn't look stuck. It just looks like it's just laying in the water. Um, but here's the thing. If a stray dog was in danger and they saw somebody come and start petting it, their their first idea would be, oh my god, this person's about to hurt me. You know, like, like their, their first instinct would be to bite them or to, to growl at them. Um, it, it, they wouldn't let, you know, some random stranger pet them when they're in danger, um, unless it's their owner, right? So obviously this person who saves these animals, well, save, saves these animals, um, he allegedly, um, runs a bunch of other channels that have been shut down in the past. On the Facebook um, page, he um, like under that video it says, um, subscribe to our new YouTube channel. Well, this YouTube channel has been around for a very long time. It's a two-year-old YouTube channel. So, and now granted, all of these videos, um, oh, this one I, I just saw, Heartbroken Puppy, limps into yard looking for help and barks on an incredible journey like a lot of these videos they're meant for facebook like that's what they're meant for um but i want to just put like a psa out there and say that if you if you come across these please report them because these people they keep making accounts and if if i if i was to talk about what youtube ignores versus you know what they act like they 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 piss me off they they really do um if, if if i was to make a um 
a video about that, talking about, you know, the stuff that they don't ignore versus the stuff that they do ignore. Um, I would be, you know, here for like hours upon hours. But I just I just want to make it clear, okay, that um, this person definitely um, has like a weird channel going on here. And they tried to hide it, you know. I think this is the channel that's still going. It's not verified, thank God. Um, but like sprinkled throughout, there's like these videos that obviously should not be on YouTube. And, you know, it. I, I just want people to be aware. There are people behind the scenes that put these animals in danger and m make money off of it. So, I mean, granted, I don't think this person can make money off of it. I don't know. I mean, probably. Um, I'm thinking that would be tied with the verified, pa uh, the verified badge on YouTube. Um, but another thing I wanted to point out was they have a... They have a, like a website. So I went to this website, and first of all, it's really zoomed in. Let me let me zoom it out real fast. Uh, there we go. Um, and this is what it is. This is what it looks like. Um, and it looks like, okay, these are just articles, you know, like news articles that you'd see. And like, okay, that's fine and all. Um, but again, like, sprinkled throughout, there's these, like, really nasty, you know, things. Less so on here, but this is, like, they they really try to hide it, though. Like, they, they try to hide it. And then at the farm, dogs, cats, horses, wildlife. Like, there's, yeah, there's so many, you know, different things that is wrong with these people. Um... It could be the same person, or it might not be the same person. I don't know. They look like it's the same person. Or maybe their videos are being re-uploaded here. Um, but this is a channel that I would definitely keep an eye out for. And if you see it, or if you come across it, um, please report it. Or, well, see, YouTube will think this is a harassment video. If you think it is something that's worthy of reporting, like if you see something that stands out, say something about it. Like do something about it um, because these people obviously like to put um, animals in danger all for the purpose of making a quick buck off of them. And I'm sure most of these videos, if not all of them, are monetized. So I just wanted to, you know, talk about that for a second. Um... Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, thank you, and I will see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.